Hello, Planet Peekaboo friends. Welcome to my office here at Peekaboo Studios. Today, I want to tell you about something I've been peeking into. Can you all say pollination? Let's all say it together. Pollination. Very good. Well, this big word, pollination, is a word that explains a very important part of the life cycle of plants. Did you know that bugs, birds, bats, and the wind take pollen between flowering plants, which help the plants make seeds, seeds that make more plants? It's simply fascinating. Here, here, come closer. I want to give you a peek into what I'm learning. Look, this bumblebee is starting the pollination process without even realizing it. He sees the bright colors of this flower and its sweet smell. This tells the bee that the flower has that perfect sugary nectar. Next, the bee lands on the flower to collect the nectar. They love to eat it and also feed it to their children. And while this bee is eating from the flower, some of the fine pollen inside the flower gets onto his legs, wings, and body. Bees can be very messy, but this is a good thing. You see, what happens next is the bee continues on his flower-eating way, flying to another flower. And when the bee lands on the next flower, the pollen that was already attached to the bee's legs, wings, and body drop into this other flower, which helps the plant make seeds. This is the pollination process, and what an amazing event it is. Oh, look who's here. Oh, that tickles. Surprise, it's me, Liliquin. Hi, everyone. Isn't that pollination process amazing? As you know, plants don't walk, so they need someone or something to bring them pollen from another plant. You know, pollen is that fine, powdery stuff inside the flower. I'm so glad the bees and the birds and even the wind deliver pollen from flower to flower, making seeds to grow more plants and flowers. Because I love flowers! Thanks for tuning in to Professor Peekaboo's What in the World! Bye-bye, Peekaboo friends! See you next time. Peek to you later. Bye-bye for now. Peek to you later.